Every generation will not be confused. There is a generation that will get this thing. Say the compressor feta bule kapas. From that day, the creative dimension of the prophetic. There must be a performance because. Guys, this is a scripture for you. Listen, if you catch this scripture, that devil that is breaking families, that devil that is shattering families, that a father and children, that, that thing will be far from your life. It's not by talk, it's by the reality of God's word. Guys, follow me. Blessed is everyone that feareth the Lord, that walketh in his ways. Verse 2. He said, for shall shall what? It's the labor of your hand. He said, happy shall thou be. And it shall be what? Verse 3. It's so it means you will marry. He said, whose wife? Come on, brothers. All these heart attacks people give themselves. It's carnality. Brothers, am I ministering to you? He said, thy wife shall be as a what? Fruitful, fine. No barrenness in your life. So says the word of God. Every factor notwithstanding. Say, ah, but we are 15 years, no child. You just hold on to the word of God. He said, thy children. That means you can have many. It is your discussion with your wife that should end it. Not medical predicaments. I wish I planned to have plenty of children. I would have proven a point, but I plan to have three. After three, I've contributed my quota to the planet. <laughs> if I'm lonely, I'll buy a puppy. <laughs> Hallelujah. He said, Thy children like olive plants. That means your children will not be stubborn. You won't go and catch one child somewhere. Police will catch him and say, Come, is this your child? You say, Yes. He said, They'll be round about your table. Take her on. Control. This is the word of God. Behold. Guys, all of you said, One, two, three. Thus shall the man be blessed that fears the Lord. How many of us fear the Lord here? This is your destiny. This is your marital destiny. What do you do? You take this word. I believe it. I take it. I receive it. This is true. This is true. I don't expect to be an irresponsible father. of job this is an issue of the word nobody's job can bring you into financial prosperity let me tell you early enough it's going to be your operation of kingdom principles hallelujah ladies let me show you the scripture i just said and then we'll pray we'll take a series on relationship we've not take a marriage marriage the home generally we've not taken it for a while turn with me to isaiah 34 quickly I just want to show you. Isaiah 34, 16. All the ladies stand up. You are going to read it. Stand up. You are a lady here. Let me not see any man standing up. Are you ready to read? Want to read? None of this shall fail. He said what? None shall want her mate. Is that in the Bible? Is that in the Bible? So, that somebody is saying that uh, you must go and parade yourself around some army officers so that the man will see you or police officer. They say they are doing POP in Kaduna. They say, let's go, let's go for our destiny. The Bible says, 
none shall want her mate. He said, for the mouth of the Lord. So it's a command. A command has been given in the earth that every woman that wants to marry, see, but it will only happen to you to the degree to which you believe. I'm a believer. I'm a believer. I'm a spiritual man governed by the word of God. He said, and his spirit had gathered them. Sit down. God bless you. Say after me, I live by the word. Shout it. I live by the word. I refuse to die young. This is not because I'm afraid of death. I have more serious business to do. I don't think death. See, when I'm traveling for a journey, I don't pray about it. I don't do this fearful prayer. If I didn't pray about it in my secret place, I don't pray to eat food. And food has never stopped entering my throat. Fear is responsible for many things that we do as believers. If the devil drives my car, he will drive me safely. I assure you. Except this earth is not of the Lord. Boldness. Audacity. This is what it means to be a spiritual man. You can look at your destiny and you can say, I'm coming. I'm coming. ABU notwithstanding. The joblessness in Nigeria notwithstanding. Look at many people running helter skelter. I refuse. I rather come and stay with God's word. People are running to all kinds of things. I hear that there's something going on in Nasarawa State now. There's a particular tribe that uh, they are, what are they doing? They are calling the people in charge of that tribe to come and register something that they are reviving their idols. They say this government thing is not working. Many families are running. Let's go. That means they've always wanted it. But my Bible tells me the name of the Lord is a strong tower. The righteous run into it. See, if it is for death, I would have died since. But the mercy of God, the hand of God, the word of God, I am convinced. Can you dare say that about your life? Guys, say it. I will never have to think over my child's school fees. Even if the school fees is one million naira per time. God is faithful. So you tight, you pray, you love God. You obey the principles of God. No rat race with my wife. I slap you, you slap me back. There is peace in your home. Say, is it possible in this Nigeria? That's, the, that's what we're talking about now. That's what we're talking about now. I'm well favored. Everywhere I go, I'm favored. I'm telling you, even those who don't love me, there is an anointing of the Spirit. It will compel them to bless me. I'm favored. I'm favored. The Bible says when a man's ways please the Lord, he makes even his enemies. His enemies. Do you believe this? The Bible says Daniel was ten times better. I refuse to be dull. You will tell yourself, I refuse that report the lecturer said. I refuse it. I'm a spiritual man. I refuse to bribe. I refuse to cheat. Sister, you will speak. I am fearfully and wonderfully made. No man will come and toy around. try to take my 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 weaknesses or my limitations and take advantage of it i'm not preparing myself for one irresponsible man you have to advise yourself are you listening to me don't behave as if you are just one cheap lady any guy that comes you are just running let's try and see 
Gain stability in the spirit. Hey, let's try. If it doesn't work, if I leave him now, where will I get another one? How did that one come? We are going to pray. Say, I'm a spiritual man. The Holy Spirit helps us. We'll take the part two of this series another time. I really need to teach on some things. Very important. Listen. Every time you agree with God, things start happening in the realm of the Spirit. Are you listening to me? There are angels that are released. There are angels. I believe this for my life. I will never be a failure in life. Never. This is not just conf It has become my reality. I won't think otherwise. See, when you stand in agreement with God, it's like a force. It will squeeze everything in time to come to the obedience of Christ. There is no power in existence, not known to man, that can stand against the word of God when it is understood, rightly applied in the name of the Lord Jesus. Did you, did you hear what I said? When it is what? Understood and correctly applied. You are bigger than what people say. Yahweh. 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 You are bigger than what people say. Yahweh. Listen. We are going to rise up and pray just for five minutes. And you are going to declare that I come out of carnality into true spirituality. Listen. There are some of you here who are not filled with the Holy Ghost. With the evidence of praying in tongues. We talk about praying in tongues. And you join people to doubt and criticize what you don't understand. Part of the traits of a spiritual man is that you are humble to learn new things. Are you listening to me? Every time Pastor Jakes announces... Thank you for watching our entire video today. If you feel you can bless someone, please join us and spread the gospel by sharing this video on your social media.